Previously, I discussed why there are no green or purple stars. It turns out that stars aren't the only things that seemingly lack green. We have red, orange, yellow, brown, black, gray, and even at least partly blue mammals. But just like stars, there don't seem to be any green or purple mammals. So why is this? Why are there no green or purple mammals? This is Pete the Squirrel. Pete is the only example of a purple mammal I was able to find, but even he might be considered cheating. He's an isolated example, the only individual of his type, and we don't know if he was dyed on purpose. As for green mammals, the most commonly cited example is the sloth, which as you can see here, is green. But this is because sloths actually allow algae to grow on their hair. In fact, moths actually lay their eggs in sloth hair, which increases nitrogen levels, allowing for algae to grow, which the sloth eats. Sloths, moths, and algae all benefit from this system, but the sloth isn't green naturally. I was also able to find the olive colobus monkey, which is supposed to have some greenish pigment in its fur, but I don't really see it. You can be the judge of this. So why are there no green or purple mammals? It's still a mystery why many mammals don't use bright coloration like birds in order to attract mates for sexual selection, or at least to aid them in camouflage. But there are some answers. Mammals actually have very bad color vision compared to other animals, especially birds, whom they shared the world with after the Mesozoic. The edge mammals had over birds and other animals was their larger brains, not their color vision. And in fact, camouflage would have aided duller colored mammals, as camouflaging mammals generally hide on earthy colored terrain, not in trees. And purple isn't really a dominant color in any ecosystem. Here's what's probably the best explanation. Mammal color is generally determined by a group of pigments called melanins. Melanin is what gives you your skin color depending on the combination of melanins in your skin and hair. There are two types of melanins that control the color of all mammals eumelanin and pheomelanin. Depending on the structure of the actual hair and skin, these two melanins can create brown, black, yellow, red, pink, and orange coloration, and an absence of melanin creates white. Basically all the warm colors, but it cannot create cool colors. So to answer the question plainly and simply, it's generally a consensus that mammals are not green or purple because melanin will not allow them to have such colors. But don't worry, there are an enormous number of mammals in the world, some with extraordinary colors, like this red panda, this golden lion tamarind, and, uh, brace yourselves, the vervet monkey. Thanks for watching.